Saturday, April 13th, 2024, 12.12 p.m. And, well, how about that? I just walk out. And what do we have to greet me? Of course, as usual. Um, and I'm thinking I'm seeing something else right here. And that is the topic of today's discussion. People, I don't know what you might be waiting for to come from up here, down here. But a word to the wise, and this is a word of warning. I've been showing you these spheres with the geometric patterns on the surface of them. More than likely, you have at least one right nearby your residence. And it is stationary. And I'm just going to say, they are watching. They are monitoring. As far as I'm concerned, these are the watchers. I have one that is always located in the western sky. And I stood outside yesterday, and yesterday it was... Oh, and we got another one. Yesterday was a very unique day for recording here. But I did none. You guys got to start seeing this stuff for yourselves. And, of course, YouTube and Google um, is not helping out matters with their... Now, I don't know what the hell that is right there. Um, and I... I don't know what that is, if I'm even catching it. So anyways, um, monitor your skies around your location. Raw recordings, you will see them within the clouds. Um, now I know a lot of you, your reference material is from that good book. Great. But I'm going to refer you to a book that might prepare you for what is coming through these spheres. You might want to check out the book. Childhood's End by Arthur C. Clarke. It was written, I want to say, in 1953. It is not to be confused, as far as I know, not to be confused with the Australian TV series. Okay? This book I read quite a few years ago. I had a hard time putting it down. Um... History dictates the future. A lot of us have information that comes with us when we are brought into this world, if you will. I believe a great many of your scientists, your philosophers, your writers, your artists, so on and so forth, um, and your great musicians, not these idiots that we see on a daily basis and being celebrated through, what is it, weekly award shows now? Through Hollywood and Nashville and all that stupidity? Yeah. Now, if you're one that partakes in watching those fake reality shows... You want reality come to this channel stick with this channel go through this channel from the beginning 
I do my best to show the reality that I've been observing. And I've been explaining it. And as far as I'm concerned, my explanations are right close to the target. Now, this is no fear mongering. This is real. If you want proof, once again, go through all of my content. I show these fears time and time and time again over the years. They are revealing themselves now. Pay attention. This is your warning. Like I like I told you in the title the other day, and like I mentioned in a video quite a while back. Today is the tomorrow that I warned you about yesterday. All you gotta do is look up. Keep looking up, you will see them. prepared people you know thinking that you got some Holy Spirit in you that's going to you know save you from everything um, then explain God's purpose for these fears they're mentioned in the Bible every time it says that an angel comes down on a cloud or anybody comes down on the cloud. Well, now we're seeing, I guess, a little bit of your biblical proof. And if you can't accept it, then I guess you have not accepted anything at all. Think about it. Keep looking. I'm trying to prepare you guys. As far as I'm concerned, don't pay attention to all this nonsense in the headline news. Look around for yourselves as to what is more important than everything else that is going on today. This is why we're not getting any answers through our government, through our military. I've been trying to show you guys for years now. Wake up. I'm out.